Hello, you join me here today in my studio, The Long Drop, and that is where this has been living for the last little while, and will be for a little while yet. It's the master mock-up of the deluxe box set, and I have this here so that I can see exactly what I'm doing with all of the artworks and all of the design, and um, how it's all got to go together and how it all works when they're all put into the box set. Now, this is the culmination of a couple of years' work, working with the team, which is myself, Danny, Adrian and Immy herself and over time we've taken what Immy wanted to include in the box set and we've turned that into a format that works to include all of these parts. We've looked at it and worked out whether there's anything more that we can put in to maximise this package and we've uh, ended up with this and this is probably the third physical mock-up that we've had made of this and um, it's fantastic. It's a, it's a weight. It's a weight and this actually hasn't got everything in it yet. I mean the card box is empty, there's uh, no vinyl in here yet and I don't believe the CDs are in here, there's no CDs in the book either. So um, if you're wondering when you look at the uh, price of delivery of this thing, this is why. It's a beast, it really is quite heavy. So um, what to do first? Well that's a big question. So part of the planning process was working out A, what we're going to do, B, who's going to do it, and C, when that needs to be done. So um, in the planning I have, oh, I'll put this down, I have my master plan of what's got to be done when here and um, the first thing on here is the playing cards and that's because the playing cards are being produced the furthest away to take the longest to get there, the longest to produce and the longest to get back. So the idea being we, we get the cards done, we send those off, move on to the next thing and then send that off and all the time these are being staggered out there, being produced and like a military operation, they all come back to the same place so that they can all be inserted into the final box set and then deli delivered off to yourselves. So um, the cards are the first bit, which would be fine, but um, unfortunately, I blame myself because uh, it's, <laughs> it's my fault, uh, the cards involve the designs from the front covers of the singles. And as you'll have seen from the mock-up, there's a few in there that we've done already. You'd have seen a few of the streamliners out there already too, which are not on here at the moment. And there are a few that have been designed but you haven't actually seen yet. But there's also a few that haven't actually had anything done for them yet, other than discussions on what we're going to do. So uh, before the first blog was recorded, which you've seen, the uh, Imi and I were sitting down discussing uh, exactly what we're going to do with these and over the next few days, uh, we're going to have to pull all of that together so that they can go onto the cards and be delivered to the card people uh, next week. So that's going to be a bit of a mammoth task. Hopefully I can bring one of the blogs to you from on set or something when we're doing one of those, which would be great. But um, beyond that, we've got um, the outside of the box. Now the outside of the box is something that hasn't actually got to be delivered yet, but I want to show you guys exactly what it looks like because it's the one piece of the jigsaw that's been missing all the way along that we haven't been able to show you because we haven't had it um, and it's the one piece that I think is is just so important for you to see and um, now we know roughly what it's going to be looking like and within that first blog we captured that master spark I can put that together and turn it into a visual that you guys can see so in the next week there, there's going to be a date down here somewhere which is going to be the uh, final date for, for submitting your footprints but um, I want to make sure this gets out to you guys before you lose your chance to um, get involved with the front cover. Now, um, on that, the front cover um, and the footprints. Uh, I wanted to make clear that these, these footprints are actually going to be on the front cover of the actual album, not just the deluxe box set. So if you buy this deluxe box set and submit your footprints, the footprints will be on uh, involved with this package, yes, but they're also going to be on the actual album, which will be released in March, globally. So the great thing about this is it means that uh, if you go on holiday or travel around the world, you can go to the other side of the world, find yourself a record shop if you're lucky, and um, pick up the Sparks album and see your footprint on there. It's an amazing feeling. Um, being a, a sleeve designer for a little while now, it's um, I, I've done it. I've gone to a, another country miles and miles away and picked up a sleeve that I've worked on, and it's just there, there's something really weird about being that far away from home and then picking up something you've done. So it's fantastic to be able to share that aspect of this with you guys so that you, you'll be able to get a little, a little bit of that too so that you can travel around and pick something up and go, hey look, 
my footprint. Um, so that window closes in about a week's time. I'm not sure the exact date, but as I say, it'll be down there. Um, so if you want to be involved in that process, then I'm sorry, you're going to have to act quickly on that one. But um, I also wanted to make clear that uh, after that process closes, if there's still box sets available, there's going to be two and a half thousand max, and that's it. But if there are still some available, they will still continue to be available, even though you won't be able to actually get your footprint in there. So um, it's, it's kind of like a two-stage thing. Up until that window, you can include your footprint on the front cover, but after that, you can still buy it, but you can't include your footprint on the uh, front cover. And that's mainly just pure logistics. I need those footprints with me so that I can actually start working with them and putting them into the artwork. And beyond that closing date, it's gonna, just gonna to be too close for some of the parts that I'm having to produce. So with that, I shall sign off and get on with the cards and get on with the box and uh, hopefully I'll be able to update you with uh, a box design and um, uh, and maybe on set with uh, some of the shoots that we're doing. But um, things change, they've changed all the way through this and I'm sure they'll change again so uh, we'll just have to see what comes up next. Until then.